the U.S. warship intercepted the ship, collecting more than 2,100 AK guns. The U.S. warship intercepted a ship in the Gulf of Oman, seizing more than 2,100 AK guns that may be being shipped to Yemeni rebels. Lieutenant Colonel Timothy Hawkins, spokesman for the U.S. Navy's 5th Fleet, said on January 10 that soldiers aboard the USS Chinook patrol boat last weekend landed on a wooden ship with suspicious signs of activity in the Gulf. Oman. When they searched the ship, they discovered 2,116 AK-style rifles wrapped in green tarps. The U.S. Navy later confiscated the weapons. When we intercepted the ship, it was traveling on a route used by many other vehicles to deliver illegal goods to the Houthi rebels in Yemen. The Yemeni crew on board attested to this, said Hawkins. According to him, the crew of the ship will be deported to an area controlled by the Yemeni government army. The United Nations in 2014 banned the shipment of weapons to the Houthi rebels, when Yemen's civil war broke out. Iran has long been accused of transferring rifles, anti-tank guns, missiles and other weapons to the Houthi rebels by sea, which Tehran denies. Iran's mission to the United Nations has not commented on the information from the U.S. Navy. Conflict has erupted in Yemen since late 2014, when Iran-backed Houthi rebels took over parts of the country, including the capital Sana'a, threatening the internationally recognized government of President Abd Rabu Mansur Hadi as living in exile. Saudi Arabia then led the military coalition that launched an intervention campaign in Yemen in March 2015 to repel the Houthis, restoring Hadi's government. With the support of Iran, the Houthis have been able to produce a series of UAVs, cruise missiles and ballistic missiles themselves capable of hitting targets deep inside Saudi Arabia, despite years of dealing with the enemy. Military operations and airstrikes by the Saudi-led coalition. Years of inconclusive fighting have pushed the poorest country in the Arab world to the brink of famine. The six-month truce, the longest in the conflict, expired in October 2022, leading to fears the war could escalate again. More than 150,000 people have been killed in Yemen as a result of the conflict, including more than 14,500 civilians.